What's up, everybody? It's Kala Cuts. Here's my shop. Let's go. Come in. Look at the view. All right. So first off, we got the chair right here, barber chair. I got this off of Offer Up. You know, I was trying to look for something a little cheap, not too expensive, and something that's usable. So this did me good. And then we got my cape. This is the only cape I got right now. Um, I ordered some more on Amazon. So all my products, material, everything, I get it all off of Amazon. And then right here, once you walk in, I know people got jackets. So right now the weather's kind of cold. So I got a hook for all the jacket, jacket holders. I don't know what you call this. And then my mirror and everybody is done with the cuts. I want to see some details, look at the mirror, you know, check them out. Then you got the TV. I uh, got this from OfferUp as well. Uh, wanted to get a TV in here, a little entertainment and my music all come from there. And then waiting area. Here we got two chairs, folding chairs. And I did this for now so people can sit. But in the future, I'll be having like, um, what is it called? Like tabletop wood planks on the wall, little, uh, add to the theme of the shop and right here we got the priceless color cuts menu haircuts are $30 youth is 20 beard mustache 10 and so on and so forth and house calls is 60 to 80 depending where you're at um, location and how many people is there is how I kind of go off of things and then if you refer somebody in and they come in I give them five dollars off and then for every four people you refer in, you get a free cut. For now, I'm trying to get my name out there. Um, I am not a full-time barber. I have a full-time job. I'm a mason in the union, and that's my day job. And right now, I'm trying to go to being a full-time barber. So next, we got a little barber knowledge from Amazon. You know, got to keep it in the shop. People that don't know, see, look at that. Look at that. And then we got some business cards for people that come in. Shout out to High Standard Auto Spa. You know, standing right behind the camera. Jordan, let's go. And then right here, we got the Color Cuts logo. Check this guy out. So when we did the shop, I wanted to do a mural on my logo and kind of put it on the wall. And my girlfriend and her brother helped me do this. So. This is how it looks like, and I'm really happy on how it turned out, way better than I expected. And this is the year I started, 2017, back in high school. Started in the locker room, cutting up hair, you know, just trying to stay in the grind while I'm in school, make a little side cash. And then over here, guys, we've got some shelves on the wall. I'll put this in to put some equipment, boxes, or whatnot that I don't use, and give a little style to the shop. So right here, I got the power clip 245 for my Babeless Pro FX and then the trimmers. Also got a power clip. And then right here, I got some product, uh, 245 Pure Powder. I had a lot of people ask me, what do I use for messy tops? And that is the way to go for that. Uh, it works really well, stiffens the hair and texturize it real good. Then over here, I got the blow dryer box and my alpha clippers. And then up here, got my mobile barber bag, GMB Pro. Shout out to them. Uh, I was really excited to get this in. Probably got it like a week ago. So can't wait to use that. And then I got another one up here. I'm going to be doing a giveaway. So shout out to all my barbers out there. Stay tuned because uh, giveaway is coming out. And then up here, got the newer ring light, two bags. Uh, I got two of them in the shop. So one is right here on the tripod. Uh, this is where I shoot my tutorials, all my videos on how to cut hair be done on here. And then I got one on the wall mounted and all my equipment, most of it, I get it all off of Amazon. So if you're ever wondering, Amazon is the way to go, find everything on there. Then to where the magic happens. So here is the Babeless Pro FX, this clipper right here, had it for like 
four years probably yeah four years and it works really good you just got to keep up with the maintenance on all your clippers everything keep up with the maintenance and it'll last long then you got the trimmers right here these guys they hit hard i had t outliners before i had this and um i just love how easy you can move around with it and uh you don't even have to zero gap them to make them hit that hard and then right here just got this in the alpha style craft and then got my slim line and this and then i also got um what do you call this the balders and this balders so i customized it and put my own twist on it and then i got the 245 power mat and then all my guards are here so i use the andis guards i had this ever since i started cutting i had the osser fast feeds i had them on them and then you can go on like a youtube tutorials see these molds right here you can attach the molds to the clips so they can fit your clippers so that's what i did and then right here i got my water water sprayer it's just a mister see that and then same with this guy different color but it's aftershave so um what do you call it? it's a good thing to put different color um bottles in your shop so you can tell the difference of water and aftershave and then right here we got the talc powder clubman whenever hair gets stuck use this guy to get it off then we got the equipment care the cool care right here got blade care and then we got clipper oil right here got my andis cool care and then to keep the shop all nice and fresh and smell so good right here the candle always have some scent or refresher in your shop to smell good because telling you one of the first things when a client walks in they notice is basically five senses scent smell sight vision everything like that so a big one is smell so make sure your shop is smelling good and then right here we got barberside you know where you clean all your combs your guards and shears all that talking about shears here we got my shears got them from amazon some gold shears match with the clippers and then over here we got some olive oil some sheen spray get that hair nice and shiny like an after after spray on the hair and then right here is my um my hairspray so i use this whenever i do hairlines i spray it down and then comb it down so whenever you start going on hairlines uh it doesn't flip up on you and then pure powder like i was talking before uh, i got one over here and then you got some 245 shave gel whenever you do razor i use this shave gel and then you got some fibers some uh, enhanced fibers from rich the barber or the rich barber and then you got some hair serum in the back whenever it blow dry it just volumizes the hair and then some cantu curling cream so cantu curling cream is a real good cream to start curling hair and they have jars like this uh, looks like this and i started off with uh, the cantu jars like this but the thing I didn't like is that every time I dip my hand inside to put it on the client, every time um, I do that, it just leaves hair in the bottle. So whenever I use it on another client, it just transfers that hair to the other person. So that is not good. So get that kind of bottle where you can just squeeze whatever you need on your hand and then apply it to your client. And then up here, we got the square reader, a little tablet to uh, do all transactions and then Got a like the square reader dock right here, so all the mobile pay, and then right here got my blow dryer, Just like that. I uh, had that guy for like three years probably, and then my workbench, Husky workbench, got it from Home Depot. We right here I carry my gloves, and a uh, shout out to A Rod Level Three. Got some sample packages of like his products that he got. Here's my razor. Got that from Amazon. All my cones, brushes, uh, remotes for the TV. And then, yeah, towel. And little stuff like that, clips. And then over here, 
Uh, I keep my receipts on whatever I buy. Just a good way to keep track. And over here, just a little case for my shears. Whenever I go mobile, just put them in here. Keeps them safe. And then over here is a, like a little handy drawer whenever I gotta do a little work around the shop or something easy. Good to have that kind of drawer. And then right here is a light drawer or like anything to do with media. I have a drawer for that. And then down here, got the barberside bottle, big bottle, some hand sanitizer, some more talc in there, comes in handy. And then right here is my cleaning drawer, uh, paper towel, simple green, window sprayer, another freshener. Always gotta keep your place fresh. And then down here, just some extra material, neck strips, some more guards, brushes, and yeah, that's my shop. All right guys, thank you for coming, tuning in. Once again, if you haven't already, like, subscribe and comment down below if you guys got any questions or you guys want to know more about the shop or even about me so i know what to put out because we got more coming to y'all so stay in tune once again call it cuts here at the barber studio see you guys you guys good Oh, you guys like what you see, don't you? Hey, wait, wait, wait. Come back. Don't worry. Color Cuts got you guys. Just stay tuned. I got more coming for all. So stay tuned.